I'm joined here today for primetime local news, Robin Tizard with Portage College. Now, the college has been selected by Colleges and Institutes Canada to offer the tuition-free supportive care assistant program. What does this program exactly offer? Yeah, so I'm very excited that the college was selected. Not only were we selected to, to offer the program, we were actually selected to be on the working group to work across the country to create this program. So I'm, I'm super excited and it, tuition free is great. So what that means is that a student that has an entrance uh, requirement of an English 10 level, and uh, if they have that and they have the ability to have a uh, clean police information and vulnerable uh, sector check, they are able to apply for this program. And then they start a six week uh, modulized, it's asynchronous. So that means they can use their own time to go through the program, but there is facilitators to help them if they get stuck on any material. Uh, but literally they can be working through the theory from the comfort of their own homes. And so that's fantastic. And really, we're really excited about that portion of the course. Once they complete that, then they will head on to a work placement. And so that will be at a site. It could be a long-term care facility, or it could be working with somebody that does home care. And they will work beside that person for four months uh, to do a paid placement. And so it's a win-win. Not only is the tuition covered, but they actually get uh, paid for the time that they work alongside of a health care aid. So this program is uh, the below health care aid. So what I mean by that is it, it's an entry level position. The, it is considered non-clinical. So the students will be doing things more like assisting with meals or participating in activities, helping a senior, for example, get involved with some recreation or helping them move around their, their home, perhaps. Uh, they would be working with uh, a team of people. So they'll be working with health care aides and practical nurses um, as a really vital part of the team to make sure that a senior's life is very rich and full. So it is an entry level. It's a great program to get someone involved and excited in health care. And where is the funding coming from for this? Yes, yeah, so uh, the as you mentioned, the program itself was uh, ran by the Colleges and Institutes of Canada. However, the funding is from the Government of Canada's Secretarial Initiatives Program. So it's coming from the federal government to help us with the uh, situation we have right now, which is where we don't have enough help uh, for our seniors in our, in our communities. And so this is to get that help for our seniors, but also get those people that think they're interested in healthcare, the opportunity to get their feet wet, uh, as we say, you know, get them out, get them that flavor of what it feels like to work in one of these places. And why do you think Portage College was selected for the tuition free program? Well, I, I'm a, I've worked at Portage for many years, so I, I obviously am a huge Portage College fan. I, I believe that we do an excellent job at training people and getting them out to, the, to, to work. And this is that program. So we were selected to be on the working uh, team because we have an excellent reputation for our practical nurse program. Uh, currently, we just received 100% on our um, review in terms of our practical nurse program, they can't get quite better than 100%. So we are very, very experts in the field of healthcare. We have an incredible uh, paramedic program. So we we know what we're doing when it comes to, to healthcare. So we uh, put in a grant application to be selected to be take part of this federal team. And we were and we were selected. So we spent the last three months working on the curriculum uh, with colleges across Canada. It was an incredible opportunity to share our knowledge, uh, share our expertise, and the product in the end was, is, is very impressive. I'm, I'm very proud of the product that was produced. And are you able to tell us exactly what's all involved in the process of taking this program? Yeah, so I think the biggest thing is that a student that has interest in, in health care aid and they have the ability to learn online. So they again, the theory is online. So you'd have to have the ability to have an internet connection. Of course, if you are by one of our campuses, you're more than welcome to come in and use our computers and our internet to do your theory. But if you have a home computer and you have internet connection, you never need to come in to do that. You can do all that from home. Uh, we will have a facilitator working with the students so that they can know where they're going to 
go for their placement, that facilitator stays with them for that whole time. So they're not feeling like, you know, that they have to do things on their own. We want these students to be successful. We want every single one that enrolls to complete and get their certificate at the end. This is a micro credential, which is also really uh, exciting. So micro credentials are a new uh, way to deliver uh, bite sized pieces of information and students will get uh, badges that they can then um, uh, put on a virtual wallet and show uh, other people their competencies and their skills. And so this program has that as well. So they're not only going to get a certificate at the end, but they're going to get badges that represent all the competencies that they've learned all the way along. So it's a really excellent thing to be able to put on their resumes. And maybe this is that motivation that they're like, you know what, this is really what I want to do. And I'm going to continue and I'm going to go and enroll in a health care aid program. Right. So we're hoping that this is a pathway for a student to then continue in the field of health uh, for many, many years for themselves, for those that find that this really is what they want to do. And for students interested, where can they register for this? Yeah, so I think the best thing is you could go to our, our college site, portagecollege.ca, or you can phone our main uh, number. So it's one 866 623 5551 and uh, then they can ask for they they can uh, talk about the program directly so it's again it is the supportive care assistant or they can ask for our continuing education program and uh, the, the people at the continuation uh, can sorry continuing education department can help them with the program uh, uh, application it's very seamless so okay is there anything else you'd like to add robin uh, well, thank you for inviting me to talk about this program because I think it's going to be an amazing opportunity, um, not only to help our seniors, but to help people that are looking for a career. Um, so if you're looking for a career and you like helping people and you just didn't know how to start, this program might be the perfect fit for you. And so I'm really excited that Portage College is able to bring this program to our region. And uh, I think it's just the starts of great things for a lot of people.